clusters seem to be loose bits of code left behind by the simulation for some reason. I've only been able to locate a small amount right now, which I'm having trouble locking onto. Once in the general area of a cluster, I should be able to direct you to its location. Kizzy, why are you sending me after these things, and where exactly are they? I'm still trying to figure out precisely what they are, but they seem like they'll be useful. There are several near my warehouse. I can't pinpoint their exact locations, but I marked the general areas for you. Um, okay. Watch your proximity meter to see if you're getting closer to the cluster, or farther away. sure this thing's safe? Safe-ish. Just keep getting them. But when we get to oh, I love this song. Come on, Kenzie, sing it with me. No, I don't think so. Oh, come on! I'll even let you be the cat. Not gonna happen. We come together. Now your turn, come on. And you know it ain't fiction. Come on! No. Kizzy, that's an order from your president. Fuck that. This is why we aren't closer. Who would have thought? We could be lovers. She makes the bed. And he steals the cup. this, but how is it amazing? It seems that anything that broke the normal rules of the simulation deposited loose data that can be incorporated into your programming. Huh. I actually kind of understand that. But since the data is so fragmented, it doesn't leave behind a complete subroutine to loop into your code base. Nope. Never mind, you're talking gibberish again. Ugh. It's simple. The more clusters you get, the more you can upgrade and alter your abilities. Ah, oh, we're talking the same language. So, three of these enough? Still missing some key fragments. Get one more and we'll see. So, if these data thingies... Ugh, clusters. Fine, clusters. If they can be so useful, then why isn't Zinyak sending his people out to collect them? Why would they need them? To give his people a boost or something. I don't know, you're the one who says they're amazing. If Zinyak wants to change the code for his people, he can just... He wrote the simulation! Yeah, but what about keeping us from... You know what? N never mind. I'm just gonna accept this and move on. Probably better that way. Holy shit! Zinyak destroyed my apartment! Ugh. That place should have been condemned a long time ago. Well, I always thought it had character. Awesome. Here, let me load up a training program for you to test your powers. What am I supposed to do in here? The code says you can jump long distances and run at super high speeds. How about starting with a small jump? Okay, try focusing on charging your jump. That should get you higher. What the hell am I supposed to jump up that? Try pushing off from the wall each jump. I can climb walls? It'd be more accurate to say you can jump up them repeatedly. Same difference. Whoa! This time I've moved the buildings apart. Try making that jump. 
liking this. Okay, now for the big test. Use your super speed to get a running start and leap to that opposite building. Oh, you gotta be joking. Just try it. Fun, but I want something more challenging. Good, because I found a race subroutine already in the city. Perfect. See? You did it! how this works. Run along the path collecting the power orbs, which should boost your new speed. Every time you hit a checkpoint, you'll be able to stay in the program a bit longer so you can reach the end. Though you probably want to avoid the firewalls along the way. Good luck! this stuff here anyway. Don't know, but it seems like when you break through any checkpoints along the race, the district's reality matrix will overload a little. That means something to me? <sighs> it means the simulation doesn't like it, and we're able to control the area. Sounds simple enough. It did the first time I said it too. You yeah, know I love you. Lies. Time to go. I'm gonna get the truck pulled up around back! Do it fast. I gotta get my dad out of here. I don't plan on dilly-dallying. Honey, take Duck into the office and barricade the living hell out of the door behind me. Glenn, when you hear me honking in the alley, start getting people out of here. You got it. Doug, Carly, and Lee, you guys make sure...